shouldn't be open access to any old horse who wants to come tumbling on down. I don't know what happened. I don't know if that was broken physics or if that was meant to happen. How's it going guys? Welcome back to St. Hazel's Horse Middle Dungeon Edition. I don't know. I didn't expect the game to go this far and it's going just absolutely bonkers drug tripping quap like physics for controlling your horse i don't know but i want to know more <laughs> thieving theresa i can't find the key card to the janitor's room the last time i saw it it was in the bathroom not a very good thief are you thanks for the heads up on that one theresa what is this muffin like a birthday cupcake or something, maybe? Scared Samuel. Please don't tell anyone I'm here. The others have been acting strange lately. Like they're being controlled. Nah, I don't see anything weird going on in this hospital at all. Johnny Johnny. <laughs> I like to think that Johnny is like an adjective. There was a lot of noise from the hallway earlier. That might have been me just beating up doctors. Mystic Margaret. Now, where did that Samuel go? If you find Samuel, would you give him this mask? It'll make him behave. Not brave, behave. Well, I'm sorry that I'm like dragging you into this cult, but I want to see what happens. No, not this again. <laughs> Scrambled name. Thank you. I can see everything clearly now. Don't make the same mistake as I did. Is he just going to go on some weird rampage now? Samuel. Who is Samuel? I'm going to follow closely behind. I'm going to bring the muffin with me. I'm going to see what happens. Uh, that was uneventful. He just came and joined everyone else. Strange. I'm going to leave you guys to it. Chili Charles. I saw some strange fellas bring a bed in this room. Now there's a weird draft coming from it. Yeah, everything down here seems uh, totally normal. I don't know how things are in other parts of the world, but yeah, Canadian hospitals, we typically have dungeons. Janitor Jameson. What in the gosh darn? Who cracked open the entrance to the hospital dungeons? See, he's aware they exist. It's just that it shouldn't be open access to any old horse who wants to come tumbling on down. I don't know what happened. I don't know if that was broken physics or if that was meant to happen. Strange creatures. Freezing Fritz. Hey, you there. Save me, Hazel. Hey, stop talking to yourself. Mind lighting these braziers for me? It's a bit cold in here. I don't think you're supposed to be down here, buddy. I should not call him buddy when there's legitimately a buddy in this game. Oh yeah, now we're starting to get some Zelda shit in this game. <laughs> Having torch lighting puzzles. Horsepital, Nintendo's new strongest IP. Oh crap, I, I just like walked into that not realizing it was a doctor. Okay, he seems, he seems protected. I have to take him out with like a trap or something. I thought this game got weird when I went to Vietnam. Had like a flashback for an event I was not a part of. The game wasn't quite done yet with being insane. Okay, there was no traps or anything. I just kind of had to sneak past people. Petrified, Petunia. Why Why did I come down here? It's so scary. Want to see if I tumble down the stairs again? Is it like some sort of joke that horses can't use stairs? Ah, oh, damn. Hazel, taking me further down. Lots of traps. Be careful. Usually I'm the one who lays the traps. A shovel oh no a key but where's scary terry are we are we getting like a little bit of a rick and morty reference in here with that i legit i want to see scary terry i want to know what that's all about Ooh, which parts which uh tr doors are open and closed changes when you flick the different levers oh they're kind of watching each other's back i can't can't sneak up on those guys Okay, everyone quit standing in like a logical, safe circle like that. I can't do anything about it when you prepare to be snuck up past like that. Quick, stomp him to death. Don't let him get back up. Okay, once, once you knock these guys down, you legit just have to like bail from it. Shit. gonna try and go a little less confrontational overall. I can't seem to stand my ground anymore. Historian Hilda, did you know this place used to be a part of the hospital? Later. I don't actually know where I'm 
I'm trying to take this key. Ah, here we go. This is a huge level. Lost Lawrence. Where the heck am I? <laughs> this is straightforward. Uh, you're maybe better off not knowing, man. You might as well just set up shop, treat this as home, and never leave. Toilet Jimbo's back! Fancy seeing you here, horse. If you can get to me, I've got something good for you. More flashbacks? You'll have to find some way to open this door. Safety Sam! This whole place is filled with traps. Are you gonna do anything about it, Sam? Jesus. <laughs> you don't want to do anything to stop this from happening, to protect us, to keep the residents of the hospital safe? This is darts. Dart guns blasting out all over the place. The complexity of these different rooms is getting insane. Like, what in God's name is even going on anymore? Oh, come on. Get out of there. You can't stay there. That's something cool, man. Oh, shit. Do I have to... So he's going to alternate between shooting these things all over the place and dropping the doors on me. So I got to, like, very specifically, carefully time my movements. Okay, it wasn't that difficult at all. <laughs> Oh no, where was the last torch that I had? Oh good, 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 good. There's several throughout the level. Hey, it's you again. Sick dungeon, right? You looking for more pills? No problem, dude. You're getting them no matter if you wanted them or not. This shit's happening. <laughs> Earth's orbit. 1961, I get to go to space. This is absolutely ridiculous, incredible. It's everything. Hey buddy, how you enjoying space? Cool asteroid. Wow, this is so cool. Hazel, why? Help me! Floating around in space like this. Hazel, this is so awesome. My brand new spaceship. It's a good thing we're wearing these helmets. This might be the most fun I've ever had. I built this spaceship just for you, buddy. Huh. What was that, Frida? I got lost in thought, thinking about how cool Hazel is. Ah, Why would you hit the self-destruct button, Hazel? I don't remember. I didn't mean to, maybe? I thought it would be fun for the lulls? Back to the dungeons, a witch cult. <laughs> Just rolling down the stairs again. Big experiment. Witches. Mind control? Leader Lucy. Come, child. Come to help, have you? Pass through the wall. Is it that easy? It is. I I guess I guess this is just the way I'm going. I'm gonna take this lantern with me. Torchbearer Trish. You're not very good at your job, are you? Welcome to the torch quarter. Take a torch if you want one. They're useful in the dark. Don't mind if I do. Could always always make do with a, a new torch. Fresh new torches all around. Miss Margaret. We are seeking glowing items of power. Please bring me a toy car? Sure, that'll do. Please bring me a glowing blue cog. You can't make a magical mixture without a good cog. Hag Heidi. This might be a challenge, but please bring me a glowing green pillbox. And Potion Brewer Patty. <laughs> it's almost finished. Once the mixture is done, try sticking your head in there. If you wish to return from your visions, simply press the sneak button. Ah, oh, I want to have crazy ass visions. More crazy ass visions. I found the pill bottle, but it's really hard to sneak around here and not be seen by things. Wonderful, just what I needed. Okay, pill bottle is secured. The toy the toy car is right there. Thank you, child. I'll sh I shall add this to the cauldron. Is it too it's too soon to stick my head in. I was wondering if there would be different levels of insanity depending how far along the brew was. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on in that room? That doctor and like whatever that other guy is look a, a bit different. There's like some shit going on in there. Crazy witch off to the side. I, I, ca I can't see any sort of like access point to that part of the map. Wonderful trash. 
Oh my god. <laughs> Dr. Whisper ahead. Of course, it all makes perfect sense. Oh, okay. I, I can't, I can't smash. I can kind of pick things up. The way I run is the most amazing thing I've ever seen. Control free Carolyn. <laughs> Having fun controlling this poor man? Remember that you can sneak to return to your body. I don't want to. I want to live this way forever. This is the, how I was always meant to be. It's like if someone had one of those rubber horse masks, but then it behaved like that episode of Goosebumps where you've like become the mask that you wear. This is what happened. You just become this horseman, and it's the best day of my life. Oh, it's such a shame to give up that beautiful man's body. Uh, there's still advantages to having a horse body, though. Several advantages. A helmet? No, this is my mane. It looks weird from the front like that. Hazel, the signal seems much better now. You must be close. Watch out for the mask, Hazel. These strange masked doctors have been working with the witches to create a monster. I'm scared, Hazel. Please save me. I don't know. These witches seem pretty chill. Manipulated Matilda. Exactly the name of someone you can trust. <laughs> We're making good progress in our research. Remember, you can sneak. Oh, I can, I can just keep doing this. Yes, I would like to immediately become a horseman again, please. Jail Josephine. I've been charged with Grand Theft Wheelchair. Hungry Harris. Psst. Hey, listen closely. You want to get out of here? See that guy over there? That's Goblin Gary. He isn't especially bright, but he does know how to block a door. If you bring me something to eat, I'll distract him for you. Hey, a muffin that actually has a purpose this time around. I didn't do anything with it before. Hey, Gary. There's a spider in my cell saying bad stuff about you. What? Stay where you are, spider. No one bad melts, Gary. Oh, God. Hide, hide, hide. Oh, crap. I was trying to sneak. Go back. Go back to the horse body. Okay. Okay. There's still time. I'm good. I'm the sneakiest man there ever was. I can't, I can't access the chests in this man body. Ooh, but what I can do is drag around limp bodies. That's something you can do as a horse or a human. Oh my god. G -g Guys, who opened the door? Oh no, scary Terry's loose. Does not look happy at all. Run! Oh, scary Terry doesn't seem so bad. You guys just gotta get to know him first. You're being too harsh on the poor guy. I'm guessing... Oh, yeah, I cleared everyone out so I can go back to being a, uh, my horse now. Uh, when it's all said and done, it feels good to be back in my horse body, stretching my horse legs. That uh, scary Terry seems to be pretty chill. Never came for me. Just let me do my thing. Every time, every time it's funny, but every time I'm like taking a drink of water during the loading screen. Dr. Stockholm! Not a big fan of stairs, huh? So it is meant to be happening. I, I hope so badly the developer was like, well, I don't want to animate walking downstairs because walking, walking animations are clearly not the forte in this game, but just teleporting him to the bottom doesn't work either, so let's just tumble him on down. Hey, we have that in common. I hate stairs too. My name is Dr. Stockholm, by the way. What's yours? Me not happy! Terry don't like horses. Terry eat horse for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Uh, it looks like introductions will have to wait. Quick, run to the treasure chamber. There you'll find a big and shiny morning star. Bring it back here and I can help you out. Why? Why? <laughs> that was how I opened this series and that's how I continue to feel. I wish, I wish Terry liked horses better. I've never done anything bad to Terry. If anything, I let him out. My stupid morning star is getting caught on doorways and stuff. I should I should plan more of a route of like where I'm trying to go. I'm kind of just guessing. Tries to clean it up for you. Oh, look at the class. Look at the moves. Thank you. What was that? Oh, big jukes. There's a doctor in that coffin. He might just be napping. I'm sure it's fine. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Oh yeah, I had to bring it back to this guy, of course. Excellent! I've always wanted to do this. Bonza! You're really good at that. A lot of pent-up energy staying in that cell. Ooh, that was fun. Now it's up to you to open the final door. Ah, uh, you're just gonna give up? You're like three quarters of the way there, dude. You might as well see it through. Get a little bit of follow-through in your actions, you know? <laughs> Another toy car. There's like a tombstone inside of the coffin with a tombstone above it. That's so stupid that it's hilarious. 
Oh, wait, lighting the, lighting the uh, braze, braziers. Braziers, none of those words matter. But that was what I had to do. I've done it. Buddy, I'm here. I'm here to save the day. <laughs> Hazel, no, it's another trap. <laughs> Sloppy horse. You were once again too late. Of course it is. Of course it would have been. I have everything I need from the witches. Hazel, wake up. Get his walkie-talkie. <laughs> Excellent. Enjoy prison. What? Oh, hello. You like jail cells? What is going on? Me too. Is there room for me in there? Hold on. Let me get this open. Funny thing. I just saw some goblins push a horse past here. Looks like they were heading for the factory. So I guess Frida is bad. Stockholm is still good. Stockholm is a good guy, I guess. He's just passively a part of this. Do you know what that was all about, Hazel? Whoa, hey, wait for me! <laughs> just rockets out of there. What is going on in this game? The glue factory, five minutes later. I was trying to go through that quickly while still following the story, and I accidentally clicked past a thing or two. It's fine. I legit would love to know more about this weird-ass cult. They all seemingly worship Scary Terry by wearing masks of him, but they're all still super afraid of him. It was hard to know what they were trying to get at there, what their end goal was or anything. I don't know why. There's a million unanswered questions. I'm not even going to start asking them. But I believe there's one stretch of this game left. We're in the last bit. This, like, factory that we're heading into. Whatever's going on there. That is, like, the end of the game. So we'll be wrapping things up next time. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon.